Hey Danny Boyle here, founder of Songwriters International, where we help songwriters develop their craft to go on and sustain a career within music. Now today, I'm gonna to share with you how I personally write songs. What is my go-to process, nine times out of 10, and how does that enable me to finish a song every single time I sit down to actually craft a song for myself, for a project, or just for writing's sake. Okay, I'm gonna share with you the complete process and how you can then implement some of the steps that I follow to see some serious success with your songs. So I'm a big believer in simplicity, in everything that I do, and that includes, believe it or not, songwriting. Songwriting should be simple, not hard, all right? You should be able to sit down and confidently write a song without writer's block, without not finishing it, without getting lost, frustrated, and all of that stuff that a lot of songwriters find themselves doing. So how I overcome that? First thing I do, step one, is an idea, okay? A very clear and concise idea. Now I don't mean a guitar hook, a guitar melody. I don't mean a vocal melody. What I mean by an idea is like a song title, a short quote. I use also six word stories. Just anything that might spark an interest for me, okay? Something that I will read, short sentence, something like that, and it will, like I say, create a spark for me to want to start songwriting. So I found an idea and then I follow a three-step method, and it's what we call the PPS, Planning Preparation Songwriting. Okay, so we take that idea, let's for this purpose, let's keep it really, really, really simple, and let's go with a song title, let's say we found it and it says, I love you, okay? And I'm like, oh wow, I really wanna write a song about that but I don't know what that is about. So first of all, I need to plan out the song. The way that I explain this, it's like driving a car. If you drive a car from your current location to let's say 100 miles away, you need a map, you need a route to get from point A to point B. We are doing this, but in form of songwriting. So we find out the journey we're going to take. So we've got, I love you, that's the song title. What is the point of the song? What is the message? The point of the song is that then we're gonna write down a little jot of what we're trying to say. Let's say in this example, it's two people who have been together from childhood. Okay, so we know they've been together from childhood. We might even say an age. They've been together since they were 10, right? They've been together since they were 10 and the whole purpose of the song is that the man is gonna ask the woman to marry him. There is the plot, there is the storyline, and now we've got to uncover that story in the song. What is verse one saying that relates to the bigger story? What is verse two saying that relates a bit to the bigger story? What is the chorus saying? And we fill in those dots and we plan our song before we actually songwrite. This is how we simplify songwriting, because songwriting, if we overcomplicate it, we don't find a point. We hit writer's block. Why do we hit writer's block? Because we don't know what we're trying to say. We don't know the message we're trying to convey to the listener. This way, by identifying the point and then unpacking it through the duration of the song, we know what we're trying to say every single time. We know what turn we are trying to make if we were in the car on a location route. Once I figured out the plan, okay, the point of the song and the verse message, the chorus message, the verse two message, and all of the other individual parts, then I will go about songwriting, okay? Or I will go about the preparation to songwrite. What I mean by that, I will get my guitars, my instruments ready that I might be using to songwrite, my pen and paper if I'm using just a standard traditional pen and paper to write the lyrics on, whatever you need to do, but prepare yourself ready to songwrite. Then we go about the process of songwriting. How I do this is I prefer to write lyrics first. Now I don't write the lyrics for the entire song. What I typically do is just write verse lyrics. So I'll write lyrics for about four lines and I won't do any more. Then I will pick up the guitar and start using the melody to tie the lyrics together. And from there, then I will just go about writing lyrics and melody together. Now that's my preferred method. You could, if you want to, you could go melody first. You could go lyrics first. You could create a fusion. You could even go to production. But what we don't do is we don't go straight into songwriting. We don't pick up our instrument and we don't just start songwriting without any clear direction. Because what happens, we get lost, right? If I pick up my guitar and I just start playing some chords 
and I'm playing here. I have no clear direction. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Um, what should I say? And all of those questions start to happen because you don't know where you're taking the song. So what we need to do is we need to take the guitar and we need to place it down and we need to figure out the plan, the point of the message and how we're then gonna convey that to the listener. So that is how I go about writing my song in a really simple step-by-step -step method. There's a few more layers to that, but pretty much that's the basics that I follow every single time and I always get a song. Okay, you should never not get a song with that method because we know what we're saying and then we can go about writing the song. So I hope you found this video useful. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Drop a comment below for any other content that you'd like to see. Drop us a like. And if you would like some further training with us, we've got a free training down below underneath this video where we walk you through uh, more in-depth techniques and tips. All right, I've been Danny Bull here from Songwriters International and I'll see you over on another video sometime.